Alright, welcome to a brand new series that I'm going to be starting on this channel. Um, Dolphins franchise will come back, but I'm having some problems with my PlayStation and stuff like that. So here we are on the Xbox 360, NCAA 13, not 14, because uh, 14 is way too expensive for me. And I'm going to be starting this dynasty with the Minnesota Golden Gophers. Um, I had a Vanderbilt one, and I have a couple games in with videos up. And I'm not sure if anybody saw those. Maybe I, I, I doubt it, but I had like four videos up. And then I was three games into the season. And I, um, it, the, the save corrupted. So I had to, uh, I, I just decided to restart with a new team and just go from here. So in this episode, I'll just mainly be doing everything that's on the screen right here. Recruiting board, registered players, dev chart, stuff like that. So I'm going to start with recruiting. I'm going to get back when I'm done. All right, just fill out the recruiting board. We got 23 people up here. We have a couple uh, decent players like Nate Hill. Brandon Crooks, uh, Christian Williams, um, Marcus Woods. There's 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 a couple decent players, a lot of bad players, and I also have some guys down here that I added that that that, that don't that don't are, that don't already have interest in us. So I'm gonna scout these guys and see who's gems and see who we might have to take off the board. All right, I have finished. Oh, didn't mean to do that. I have finished scouting. Uh, everybody here, or mostly everybody. Um, Nate Hill goes up three. Crook stays the same. Williams went down three. I added a couple court. Uh, I added a couple quarterbacks. You'll see that when we get towards the bottom. That are better than him, and he's just gonna be our backup plan. Like if we if we don't if we can't sign any other two guys, and we um we'll just get him because he's like, I mean he's the number one. Like he he we're his number one school, so we'll be able to get him pretty much easily. Uh, Tariq Anderson, the guard, goes up four. Dave Johnson, the wide receiver, goes up five. Um, Lance Harris, the cornerback, goes up nine. And we still have about 30% left to scout on him. So he could go up over ten. Uh, Michael Hines goes up seven, offensive guard. And there was, some, there was another guard, I think, too. And uh, some of these guys did pretty good. Um... Fred Harris, who is a guy that I really want to go after, he goes up two to a seventy-one, so he could be pretty good. Um, Kyle Higdon goes down one, but still a sixty-four is not bad. C.J. Coleman goes down two. Doug Ross goes down two. Brigham goes down four. Marquez Callaway goes up four though to a sixty-nine. So and we still have a lot to uh, a lot to do for him. So. That's not bad. And then the quarterbacks that we added are Jason Lacey and Lee Livingston. Now, Lee Livingston went down five, which seems bad, but he's still a 71 overall, which is probably better than the quarterback that's on the current roster. So he's not... T he, he, if we can get him over Baylor, that'd be a big addition to the class. And then there's also Jason Lacey, who doesn't look too bad. 83 speed, all right throw power, all right throw accuracy, 66 overall. So he could be a guy. He he could be a nice. He could be he could be nice. He could be a nice add to the class as well. But so those are my top two quarterbacks, and then Christian Williams is my number three guy that I'll kind of I'll 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 just pick up if um if um if the other two don't accept. Now red shirting. Uh, I'm I gotta look. <laughs> I haven't really looked at this roster much. So our best player or our best quarterback is an 82 senior scrambler so he's gonna be gone next season i think i'm gonna redshirt eric lowry 79 speed um he he'll he, he could be the starter next season as a redshirt sophomore now running backs will redshirt quentin coley wide receiver oh i like this two night two of our top three receivers are freshmen true freshmen and they look pretty solid so I don't like his eight, I don't like Nick White's 82 speed. But I think other than that, we should be in business with them. Uh, tight ends will leave alone. Uh, we'll redshirt Hunter Richardson. We'll redshirt Troy Jenkins. Unless there's another spot we can move him to. There's not. Okay. I'm just going to try to uh, redshirt any freshman that I can. 
like Michael Ferguson, just guys that don't like if you're at the bottom of the depth chart for your position, you're just gonna get redshirted. No point of wasting a year of eligibility. So I think that's gonna be it. Um Yeah. That's gonna be it for the red shirts. Unless there's a kicker or a or a punter. There is not, so we're going to have the depth chart, which I think, looking through those players, I think I'm going to ma mainly uh, keep it the same. But schedule, I don't want to play any FCS team, so we're going to take them off the schedule, and we're going to put, I want to put a ranked team. I saw Arkansas, Alabama, Clemson, FSU. We'll play FSU. Let's do FSU. Let's put FSU on the schedule. Uh, UNLV could be a pretty good starter game to kick off the season. And um, we have some tough games down the road. W ranked Wisconsin, ranked Michigan, ranked Nebraska, Nebraska, ranked Michigan State. So some tough games down the road. I think I'm going to take off Western Michigan and put on a, a better team. No, it doesn't have to be a ranked team, just a better team. Like, who do we want to put on? Um, do, uh, we'll do NC State. So we have an A plus strength of schedule, which I like. Make this make this season tough. I want to make all the seasons tough. And um, yeah, that's gonna be it. I think I'm gonna play the first game in this video. So let's hop into it. All right, well, I'm doing recruiting, and uh, Christian Williams, the quarterback, just committed. So, I mean, I did take one of the quarterbacks off because we were, like, eighth on his list, and we just had no chance at getting him. So I guess that's not a bad start for the series. And also, we get cornerback Lance Harris to commit as well. Uh, I mean, two, two commits in the first episode. I can't complain about that. All right, here we are in the first game of the season. Going up against UNLV, we're at UNLV. We lose the toss, they're probably going to defer because they always do that, yep. And the first drive of the season is going to be on offense. Now this game is only going to be 5 minutes, but in the future they will probably be 6 uh, or 7 minutes. I'm only doing 5 minutes for this one so that, so that the, vi the, the video ain't like 50 minutes long. So not a bad, not a bad return out to the 24. The thing that sucks about this team is basically the whole offense is v the the offense is very bad. Basically, outside of the quarterback, and I almost throw a pick on the first play. I, got, I think I gotta I gotta run some options and stuff like that to to get the quarterback in his space because that ninety speed he's probably the fastest player on offense or one of them. So it's gonna be fun to use Lewis for this season. Hand off to Smith. He picks up five. It's gonna be third and five. All right, third and five. Let me hold on. Let me make sure that the audio is good. Okay, I think we're good. Bump that up a little bit. All right, we're good now. Third and five. Let's see what we're gonna do. Gonna roll out. Can we get to the outside? We run past them. Lewis picks up the first down. Let's go. Studio update. Ball State is destroying Michigan, or Eastern Michigan, or whoever that was. <laughs> but let's see what we got now. That that's definitely something that I'm gonna take advantage of using Lewis for this one season. This is the only season that we're gonna that we're gonna be that we're gonna have him for. So those scrambles are gonna be very good. Got X across the middle. Grant and he drops it. Ah, damn it. All right. Let's see. I'm gonna try to. I'm gonna run the ball here. 
run the ball here on second down. It worked the first time we ran it, so hopefully we can get similar success for this next time. Turn the audio up. But, uh, it's kind of... Oh, big hole. Stan Smith picks up 11. Let's go. All right, first and 10. I'm going to try to hit him with a speed option here. And we got blockers. Oh, the tight... I, I, I probably should have lateral that, but I was really hoping the tight end could, could pick up that block and we could take it all the way. But so Lee Lewis picks up three. Gonna run a smash right here. I could try to hit. I think I'm gonna. My main read is gonna be the seam route going across the middle. He gets past the defense. Bennett in for the uh, in for the touchdown. Let's go, man. Seven nothing early to start this one off. Let's go. All right, gonna start the first play of the for on defense of the season is gonna be blitzing. And Williams for UNLV picks up 10. This is not a bad UNLV team. I've used them. They're, they're not even that much worse than we are. We suck. Like, we we, we have, like, C's across the board. And UNLV, UNLV is just not that bad. Like, they, they, they're not that much worse than us. Oh, that's probably really loud. My bad. Yeah, it's going to be tough to stop them. They have a really good offense. Their defense is kind of suspect. And I'm not really good on defense on this game either, so... I'm expecting that's where we're gonna get torched a lot. Brown drops back. It's gonna be a check down the wood and he drops it. Alright, second and ten. Let's see what they're gonna do. I'm guessing it's gonna be a handoff to the running back. Probably gonna be wrong. Yep, it's gonna be drop back to pass. And he put that on the money over the top to Barclay. What a dime. I can't even hate on that. That was a good pass. And I mean, I I, I could have stepped back with uh Thor with with Horn, but didn't. So what are you gonna do? Hand off to Williams. He shoots it up the hole, and Horn brings him down for no gain. Let's go. All right, let's see. Play action. He's throwing it up to the end zone. Mitchell is there with the pass deflection. Cannot hang on for the interception. Now that sucks. That'd have been nice to get the ball back. The turnover in the end zone. But let's see what we got here. So it's really not a great pass rush. I'm not predicting too many sacks this season. It's going to be a check down to Stovall, and we get the big hit, forcing the fourth down. I'm going to hold him to a field goal. All right, UNLV, <laughs> they missed the field goal, so we're going to keep our seven point lead. They could not convert. Um, Yeah. Oh, that's not great. That was good defense. I should have. Desktop audio will be getting loud, man. Let me turn this down. I don't really know a good, uh... Because the, the audio from this game to Madden is, is way different. Because they get, like, they get loud when, when something good happens. So... I'm just going to hit the check down to, to Winston. That was a terrible throw, but he still gets six on the play. That's going to be the last play of the first quarter. Alright, third and seven. First play... Of the second quarter, let's see what we got here. I might take off with Lewis and scramble. I see the blitz gonna dump it down to White. He catches the ball and picks up the first down. Let's go, man! Keeping the drive alive. Gonna try to hit catch the defense off guard with an end around right here. There, it looks like they're blitzing that safety, so this could get open. We cut it up with Turner. Blocks open. Let's go. Turner picks up 12. Not bad. Not bad. I see right there. First down run. Picks up the first down and a couple extra yards. We're going to try to hit him with a read option here on first and ten. Definitely going to run a lot more options with Lewis. I like having mobile quarterbacks. Going to keep it. Left side's wide open. We have a blocker. Oh, damn, man. <laughs> I mean, it was a good pickup by Lewis, but that corner. Dang. Took my knees out. All right, let's see what we got here. First and ten. That's like three first downs in a row, man. Offense is cooking right now. Just gotta keep it up. See what we got here. Gonna run a little flanker. Flanker drive. That's tough right there. They might take it for six unless we can bring him down. Yes, we can. That was a terrible throw by me. Uh, I mean, that was a good play by the linebacker too. I just did not. I mean, I saw him, but I thought I could. I thought I was gonna be able to kind of squeeze it in there. I guess not. And UNLV gets the ball back, so. And they take off instantly with Brown. Breaks the, t breaks the sack and gets six. 
I gets gets four. Sorry. So let's see what we got here. Second and six. I'm predicting a run. Could be wrong though. It's gonna be a run. We had him. Moore brings him down to the 25. Man, ah, defense is especially especially at, at up front. The the front seven is just getting gashed, which is to be expected since we have a terrible D line. But dang, I didn't expect it to be this bad. Blitzing with Patrick. And the post route over the top to Barkley, and he drops it. What a what a break we catch right there. That was an easy touchdown. That was a great throw by UNLV by the UNLV, UNLV quarterback. And good play by the two outside by the by uh, the two linebackers on that on that uh, <laughs> can't speak on that uh, left side, stopping them for a, a, a loss of one. Gonna try to blitz with McFadden here. We can't get in there, and he's short. Fourth and inches. Are they going to settle for three, or are they going to go for it? I would go for it if I were them. Looks like they're going to take their three. Let's see if they're going to miss another one. Oh, it's probably going to take a little while. <sighs> of course, they have to drain the clock, but what are you going to do? Who's Matt? Oh, that's the Minnesota Matt. <laughs> I was going to say, whose mascot is it at the top? Should snap it now. Kick is up. Kick is good. It is 7 3. Alright, first and 10 to 20. We get the ball back after the UNLV field goal. Let's see what we're going to do to start this drive. I like B. It's a bad throw when it's intercepted. He. Oh, that's a terrible throw by me, man. That's a terrible play by me right there. I, I can't lie. Let's see what we got here. I'm going to drop back, fake the blitz. Brown's going to scramble. We're on that. He picks up eight. They're going to call a timeout. Okay. Gonna, probably going to have to put up a spy soon. Going to run man. Put the lineman on a spy. Not bad coverage. And Morris jumps the route and picks it off. Let's go. Good, great play by the defense getting us that ball back. Because that could have been bad right there. For sure. That could have been really bad. Hopefully, let's see if we can capitalize. We got about 40 seconds. We got three timeouts. We got plenty of time. We have a. I mean, we got to go about 75 yards, but I think we could do this. <laughs> Another bad throw by me. It's almost intercepted. I got to chill on on some of these throws, man. So I, that that one was a really bad one. I definitely got to relax. Only take what's. Just gotta take what's given to me. No need to force anything. Oh, what a throw. What a throw to White. Let's go. And I think he gets out of bounds there. I could be wrong, but I, I want to say he got out of bounds. I believe he did. Yes, he did. That was a great throw on the corner out. From Lewis to White. Let's see what we got here. Might take a shot deep. I think I'm just gonna throw it up to B. Oh, we got RB underneath. No need to force anything. White again. He picks up 11. 11 or 10. 10 or 11 there. You know, great. Just good. Good. Um, When, you know, the the uh, the pass blocking is very, very inconsistent. At least for this first half of the season. It's been either really good or really bad. And we got A coming across the middle on the post. That is right. And right gets in for the second touchdown of the game. Let's go, man. 14 to 3. Alright, UNOV does get the ball to start off the second half, though, so they could trim the lead down. I mean, a field goal makes it a one-score game. So let's see what we got. It's going to be a handoff to Williams, Baker, and the D -line, one of the D linemen there to hold him to a five-yard gain. Just hope, they, hope we can play more consistently on defense. You know, it's either been like a, it's either been a, gain, a pick up for, of no gain or a pickup of like seven yards, it seems, for UNLV this game. It's going to be a check down out to the running back, Nelson, and he drops it. Heard the footsteps of uh, Baker there. He just didn't hang on. Ball State's up 21 on Michigan. Third and five. Let's see what we can do here. A stop here would be great. Go, we could get the ball back, have a chance to go up three scores. Got a guy in motion. 
They're going to check it down. We can't get out there. And they take up the first down. All right, first and 10. Got a blitz sent. Got a, got a, sending a blitz here. It's going to be a check down out to the running back. And Williams picks up about 14 yards. All right, first and 10 again. UNLV has been has played really well on offense this game, and we almost get the first sack of the season. The defensive end there can't see his name, but number ninety three. I'll look at that. Uh, ninety three. He's not in the game right now. So I'll take a look at that uh, after the game. See who got that. But great, that was a good rush right there. Got a guy in motion. It's gonna be play action. Check down out to Nelson. We bring him down. It's gonna be third and five. Third and five. Definitely going to be sending the blitz here. Got to make sure it's a man blitz, though. They would seem to work a lot better. And what a play! Carter gets the QB hit in almost a sack on, a, like, two plays earlier. And then he gets the pick six. What a play right there, man. You love to see it. The linebacker comes in, f gets the hit on the quarterback off the blitz. Ball goes right into Carter's hands, and he takes it for six. 21-3. Let's go. <laughs> All right. UNLV is back out on offense after that that, that a weird pick six from the defensive end. And they got a guy whooping in the middle of the field. It's a bad throw. And Cooper gets the interception. And that might have been the guy. We have two white linebackers. So that, I'm, I'm not really sure if that was the guy who... Um, who who got the hit on the quarterback on the pick six play, or if it was a uh, horn? I think it might have been horn, but let's go, man. That's a great play from the linebacker in the middle there, and a really bad throw from UNLV's quarterback shooting the hole with Smith, and we pick up seven. Not a bad gain on first down. Let's see what we got here. Definitely want to take a shot to the end zone. Just not sure when. Gonna try to hit him with just a quick bubble screen here. Just pick up the first down, or I'll just hand it off. Handoff is a lot more safer. And we get nowhere. Loss of one. It's going to be third and four. All right, third and four here. I'm, I'm looking at either the running backs or the guy on the dig route. Got the running back open. So Williams out the backfield. He picks up about almost 10 yards. Gets the first down. Lee Lewis, 144 yards on the game for him. And he has two touchdowns. He also has two picks. But defense helped us out. And, um... They didn't really lead to much, so that's good. Going to hit him with another read option. Going to cut it back inside. Pick up five on first down with Lewis. Might not be, not, might, not, might, might not have been the greatest read right there. Probably could have kept it uh, to the outside. But we will continue. I think I'm going to hit 27 off the backfield right here. Yep, that's wide open. Miller, and he drops it. That, that, that was... That was easily a first down, maybe even a touchdown. So let's see what we got here. Third and five. We're three for three on third downs. We played, we've played. we done really well uh, in that part of the game. I'm going to send X on a streak. Maybe he can get past. And they leave the tight end wide open. Grant into the end zone. That's another touchdown. 28-3. to three. Alright, UNLV back out on offense here. See what they're going to do. Check down's open. Cooper and Horn combine to make the tackle. And that's the first down for UNLV. I think there's going to be maybe one more play before the quarter ends. And we head into the fourth. But not sure. Yep, they're going to snap it. I'm guarding the, oh, blank, Blanco, or Blanco, 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 however you say that, almost jumps back, could have been another pick six, he was inches away, inches away from get to, from taking that, whew, defense has played really well this game, we've given up a couple, we, you know, we haven't been great, I, I, we, we've given up some plays, but we've made a couple turnovers, which has really changed the game. So, yeah, we'll take that. Slants. We're going to break off, and Stover gets the sack. That isn't uh, Smith who got the pick six earlier. That's a different edge rusher. 
I guess the first sack of the season for us. So we will definitely take that. Kind of wish it was a uh, Smith though. <laughs> or was it Carter who got it? I don't know. It might have been Carter. I, I feel like his name was Smith though. I, I think it was Carter. I'll look. I'll, I'll, I think it was Carter, number 93. Pressure gets through. He scrambles out there and there's nobody there. And another UNLV first down. Alright, gonna be running this cover two sink with the safety on a spy. Just to kinda keep just to keep him contained. And a great throw. Wow. Threw it right over three defenders. That was a great throw. Okay. I mean they the UNLV's played pretty well on offense this game. But it's mainly been the turnover, and the, the fact that we're scoring off the turnover, and that's another guess gonna be a false start. <sighs> Excuse me. First and fifteen. Let's see what they're gonna do here. Motion the tight end out. Got Towns, the receiver, wide open. They pick up seven on first down. Second and seven. Gonna send a man blitz here. Oh, almost got that pick. Man blitzes are definitely, they, they, they're much better than zone blitzes. Which, I mean, obviously, because it's kind of, especially because man coverage feels really overpowered in this game. I saw, <laughs> yeah, touchdown UNLV, I, I knew that was going to come because there was a linebacker on the slot receiver, so 28 to 10. All right, and we tack on another touchdown. Stan Smith gets his first of the season. It's only 22 seconds left. I was able to run out most of the clock, so that's just going to be it. All right, game over. We win 35-10 to against UNLV. Good uh, warm-up game for the season. Lee Lewis, 9-15, three touchdowns, two picks. Not the greatest game, but some the mistakes were, my, were on my part. Stan Smith, the junior running back, 9 carries, 63 yards, and a touchdown. Uh, Lee Lewis had 4 for 30, and Albert Williams, who came off and then had a couple nice runs at the end. I guess 2 for 14, and then also Terrell Turner had uh, 12 on an end around. Uh, Nick White, the freshman receiver, he's he played really well. I'm going to look to definitely get him more involved in these next couple games. 3 for 55, he played really well. Uh, J.D. Grant, the senior tight end, gets a touchdown to 20 yards. Uh, Michael Wright with a 30-yard touchdown, and Antoine Bennett with a 47-yard touchdown. Defensively, John McFadden led us in tackles, tied with Jonathan Horn and Chris Baker. Um, Sack-wise, John Stover, the junior defensive tackle, got one. Uh, Jeff Cooper got an interception. David Carter with the pick six, and uh, Steve Morris also with an interception. TFLs, John Stover and Jonathan Horn with them. Deflections, James Mitchell was the only one with, with was the only guy with one. All right, all right, and our third commit of the episode, Michael Hines, the center or the guard, sorry, commits right away. So that is our third commit. So we're having a pretty and and I put the difficulty on Heisman too. So. We shouldn't be getting much more of those. But that that that's great to see. Three in the first episode. That's a wonderful start. And we get another one. Tight end to Marcus Lane, who's only a 50 overall. I mean, these recruits aren't really like the highest rated. But I mean, it's just nice to kind of. This is cool to to get them. All right, just advanced to week two. We got number eight FSU, unless they dropped or went up. They're still number eight. It's gonna be a home game for us, which is nice. I mean, they're way better. I'm not. I'm not going in expecting a win, but I'll definitely take one. So uh, that's gonna be it for this one. If you enjoyed, please hit like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.